Slide the left leg out into a sitting stance, perform a slow measured middle punch. And then perform a double punch at normal speed. Foot to foot into another sitting stance and then again using your right hand, a slow middle section punch followed by normal speed double punch. Moving your right leg into a walking stance on 45 degrees, performing a high section in a forearm block. Left leg, low section, front snap kick, followed by a double punch. Moving the left leg into the opposite corner on the 45 degrees, into a walking stance, high section, middle block. Performing a low section, front snap kick, followed by a double punch. This is a new block now guys, again performed in a walking stance, this is a hooking block, it's a wrist grab. And then on the spot you perform a left hand hooking block, followed by an obverse punch. Then you step forwards, perform that hooking block again with the left, then again with the right, and then an uh, obverse punch. Step forwards with a single punch in a walking stance, and then you go up into a bending stance with the left leg up, Perform a middle section side kick, land in walking stance, elbow strike with the right hand. Spot turn, do a bending ready stance again with the right leg in the air, perform a right side kick, and then once again an elbow strike with the left hand. Move the left leg into an L stance, perform a twin knife hand block, stepping forwards to walking stance, flat fingertip thrust. Turn 180 degrees, perform an L stance, and once again a twin knife hand block. Stepping forwards into a walking stance, flat fingertip thrust. Face the back of the room, perform an outer forearm block, followed by a reverse punch as in the first two moves of Do San. And then stepping forwards into walking stance, repeat that outer forearm block, and the reverse punch once again. Step forwards into an X stance, followed by a back fist strike with the left hand. Pivot into walking stance, and now once again, this is a new move. This is a double forearm block. And then foot to foot, step it out, and make sure you step wide into the walking stance once again, into the last move, and this is a repeat of the previous move, a double forearm block.